Hey guys, my name is Chaos Advos and uh, welcome to a uh, little update of oh, Fog. Um, so yeah, uh, first off, I wanted to talk about my PS4. Now, my PS4, as you can tell by oh, behind me right there, is not work. It's not apparently not working. Um, it's nothing about you know that I can't log in or or matter that if I can't sign in. Or anything like that. It's just that um, it's not starting up as properly. So you may see it as a big uh, blue screen right there, but uh, I don't know what the I don't, I don't even know what the fuck I'm supposed to do at this point. So and I haven't really did this for a while. Like you know, we did my own vlogs, but you know, using my phone. That's what that's all right. And, uh, <coughs> and I thought. Maybe I feel a bit more bit confident by using my webcam, as you know. There you go, up there. And also, you can probably not see much, a lot of shit behind me. And also, that big blue screen. Now, I don't know how it's going to run, but I'm going to be showing you guys how fucked up my, P my PS4 is. Um, and I can tell you how I feel with the console. Right, hang on two seconds. So, you may be wondering about this no beating right and it's going to cut off in a few seconds so while that's going apeshit and uh, it was cooled down at first and pardon me it was working fine no matter what and you can tell yes this is my hair I <coughs> kind of you know go out here and also I thought why not I have a wee change myself because this is me so yeah and don't worry about that fucking fringe because apparently I'm stuck with this piece of shit for a while and it's been a bastard anyway we're not here about my hairdo we're not here about my old style I am basically just talking about my piece of shit console so for for, for TOA I'm going to show you how annoying this thing is watch so basically my console is Right, right now, I can feel a little bit warm. It's a little bit warm, a little bit hot, a little bit. But when I start this up, it won't. You can hear it beeping, right? And then at first, the, the only thing is that it doesn't even go. So if I press it again, it lights up. Now, if I put that on, that indicates that. So. While we're waiting for this nightmare to start, um, I don't know if you guys can hear me when I was over there, but you can tell. Uh, right now, it's showing a bit of bright blue or dark blue. I thought it would show a color, like an orange color or a red color, that it might just die out. But this is what happens it sticks to that. Right? And the reason why, before this has actually happened or even started, I thought, why not? I'll put. I, I was thinking to myself, maybe I would play Devil May Cry. Now, Devil May Cry Five, I was kind of slowly enough to want to go back into streaming uh, before the big game wasn't even late. Um, but the only problem is, uh, yeah, I tried to install Devil May Cry Five. It worked. It worked fine because I wanted to try the, the DLC because um, I thought why not I'll take a wee break before I start recording because I was going to record a little channel update on Disney the way you guys have a feel about the Guardian games and the other shit it was going in and I hope that because while I'm recording on the webcam I noticed this bar it's like a cross a white bar cross hopefully that just disappears when I wee check it but anyway <coughs> this is what happens right so I went and reinstalled the game. I reinstalled I installed the the add-on for it, putting this module. And then out of nowhere I start the game up, I went into mission select, choose Virgil, and then after that that was it. I was getting ready to play the game. You know, just to take a wee break, because I was on recovery because of my chest right here, it's been hurting me like a bitch. And uh, yeah. And then this crap pops up. Constantly, about six or seven times. Now, if I go on it, 
Hold on, let me just do that. Uh, <coughs> I have no idea what's going on with it. Now, for a few seconds, for a few seconds, it will have. Alright, so there you go. It says here, press it, p the PS4 is too hot. Turn up and then there we go. And then if I double check it again, right, hopefully you guys can hear me in this when I'm up there, it's like, it's fucking annoying. And yeah, you can tell there's a bit of a hair sticking out from that to one side. But anyway, that's the one I thought. <sighs> it's turned out a wee bit warm. Now, I have no idea what the fuck is going on with my PS4. Yes, it is an old console because I had it. This is like my second, I think. Uh, I have one there. Yeah, yeah, so this is my second console. The first one, it broke down on me so many times and I saw steam coming at you and I thought, nope, you're dead. You're definitely dead. So, I got of that, and then whenever I go back there, this shit goes again. Now, normally, when it says it was too hot, it usually it, it fucks up either of my other games, but it doesn't really crash, actual shuts down or close down the console entirely. Um, I can give you a couple of samples. First one was Predator. The hunting grounds, which was a good game for a start, and then it just that, and then a lot of people didn't want to play it, so it I died out very well, very quickly. I mean, uh, what else? It did that for Resident Evil 2 for a couple of times, and then after that, it went back to normal. So I don't know what the fuck happened to that one. The other side, the horror supernatural game that I played and streamed and let's played for that, that happened several times on PS4 and even that is streamed and I couldn't really play it I couldn't really play it long enough and he even did that for Cyberpunk but again, not Cyberpunk I don't care about that now <coughs> this shit has been constantly burning out non-stop now, now I don't feel any heat I don't feel, I don't see anything coming out of it I don't see anything wrong with it I just think the console is basically fucking dead so when I was going to stream Resident Evil 8, that's definitely going to be not happening anymore. Sadly. <sighs> so I'm basically back to square one again. I can keep the console until I get a new one. Well, technically I can get another PS4 because that's the only thing I can even really buy. Because thanks to all those stupid scalpers who's took most of the majority of all the PS5s. Um, and I'm basically stuck with another console. And I can even just transfer all my shit, all my data, all my saves, all my whatever, the crap I can put in into the other one and hopefully I can get it then. But that's going to take me an extra few days. So what do you think I should do? And this is the comp, this is where you guys come in, tell me what I should do with this console. Do you think I should just wait until get until I get another PS4, do you think I should get one, another one, or get like a PS5 and try and, and get one. So, yeah, I have no freaking idea. And I was also going to be taught, and also there was other things that was basically just driving me nuts, because I know there's certain games that's going to probably come out in the far future, but, oh well. Um, so yeah, Resident Evil 8, village on stream on the 9th I was going to sh no oh no 9th the 8th sorry I was going to stream that game on the 8th roughly 6pm or 6.30pm at my time in the UK but the only problem is because that console died out I can't really do much and I'm basically screwed I'm basically going insane so what I'm going to try and do <coughs> is I'm going to try and work on certain PC games. Now, most of my PC shit is usually runs certain games that are quite well. 
I was going to do like a little nip and pick games, like, you know, just little highlight moments, just like little games that not like full, uh, full let's plays or anything, because again, I want to do my let's plays on that more than anything, and then probably do that, makes it easier. But <coughs> since my PS4 is dead, well, basically, kind of like dead, I don't know what's going on with it, probably the the shit that's inside of it, it's just probably just burn out or something, I don't know. So I can't really do much, so if you're respecting any new gameplays or any new content, and unfortunately it's done. So I can't really do much, I can't really do anything for requirement or that, and uh, yeah. So I'm a little bit, again, I'm a little bit nervous because I, I, I was going to save the webcam and thing maybe when I feel a bit more confident for <coughs> uh, when I'm doing streaming on PC but I don't know I'm still learning about the whole thing I'm still learning about the whole fucking streaming thing from because I'm still using my some of my software stuff to try and record stuff because thanks to the Xbox the app thing that won't work because of my e email my Microsoft email account thing is just broken, it won't let me fix that, so I'm basically struggling on that, that. and I'm struggling, now I'm struggling on this, which basically my room is not that really hot, and even the console itself, it doesn't really burn out that much with older games, so, and I don't get why it was overheating with my, my Devil May Cry game, so, <clears throat> I'm a little bit protect, I'm a little bit pissed for that, and as you saw there, there you go, full witness, full proof, that thing is done. <sighs> so, that's where I need your guys to tell, I need you guys a pop thoughts and opinions, what do you think I should do? Because probably roughly next week, I know Resident Evil, so, uh, Resident Evil 8, the, uh, the village, will be coming out this week and I won't able to do anything, I won't able to stream anything and basically I can't, I can't, well I technically I can get the PC version but it means that I'm not going to really like, you know, I'm not going to record, I'm not going to, I mean I'm not going to be able to stream it and then even that, the software I'm using, it will tell me that oh it's not going to be compatible for my PC because it's not part is not like good enough on it and I have the way really fuck around the settings and that and I don't want to do that so if you guys are interested if you want me is to do a full playthrough on Resident Evil 8 on PC then I'll get it if not and if you're really patient and you really want to see my reactions to the PS4 because again, I, like I said before, I can't get the PS5 because every time I check online, it says none, simple. So I don't know where to get one. I don't know where to hunt for one. I've been like, looking around online. My mum has been trying to looking out for stuff online for me to see what's new, or any news or any rumors, you know, any of that is going to kick off. So, um, yeah, so I'm kind of pissed. That, that thing is definitely better. Uh, <coughs> sorry, kind of spat on my um, PC. Um, so yeah, so I have no idea. And um, going through the other topics, where I was going to say on my when I was on Destiny, on the vlog thing I was going to do, uh, I was going to talk about. Last of Us Part 3. Now, normally in Last of Us Part 2, I when I first heard the, the rumours and the game was coming out, um, I thought it was going to be generally good. I got suckered to play that game, and I regretted it. Instantly. Because of I listened to Neil Druckmann's lies, and a few of his friends. Talking, oh yeah, this game is so good. GG. Yeah. But anyway, Knowing the fact that I was pissed, I continued it, and I played it, and I gave my own thoughts about it. You, if you want to know about how I felt about the game, watch the last two parts 
on the playlist on Last Man's Part 2 and you will explain that will exp that will let you guys know how I felt about the game but going back to about the third seek the third game of it it's going to be super bad now the reason why I think it's going to be bad is knowing the fact that it's going to be more talk about it's going to be more about the story about Abby that's how I think of it the HBO, I don't know how they're going to work that out because I know there's a lot of fans just like half of the fan base likes the game and probably like the HBO and then in the other half probably I'm in this group that they hate the fucking game now, I don't blame them if they're going to go for that path and they're going to end up watching it and then probably weep and then play the third one good for them but I, I'm going to feel sorry for them if they get turns out that if that third game becomes dog shit I won't be playing it and I won't be getting it and it, when that comes out I know it's just rumour and just like it's speculation but nah I'm not fucking playing or touching that filthy game generally and to all of it, make it even more funnier right make it more funnier they're planning to remake trying to remake the first game why it is a power of dog shit if you're making if you're going to butcher that the story and the whole we cat we creating the cables again it's going to make it horrible fucking worse and i'm telling you this and i'm looking at you in the eye um it's going to look like dog shit so <coughs> i know i have like all from the side there that's why if you think i'm looking down don't worry, I'm looking at you to it in the camera. But anyway, uh, let's see. Ah, here we go. So, that's how I felt <coughs> about the game, and I don't really like it. And if they do remake that one, I'm going to just stick with the remastered, because the remastered was the cross, and it was only, what, probably a couple of year old, roughly. So, that's what I'm going to say, and I'm happy with that. But, um... Yeah, and Guardian Games, I didn't mind it as much, and I was going to record but yeah, after I take a wee hour break and try and play Devil May Cry 5, but as you know, console dead. So, <coughs> and yeah, so, <sighs> there's a lot of things I had to talk about and it has to be the baddest times on my PS fucking 4. Cheers, <sighs> I am bro. Cheers, I position 4 you died very well you ha I had you for free maybe for you rest in peace anyway so that I'm just really fucking tired um, so yeah so again again I've been just and from all the from the game inside the things I just been basically just tired I was just exhausted um and uh i just kind of felt burnt out from playing destiny and stuff sure i've been playing outlanders a little bit which was fun but until the expeditions were biting my heart kicking my ass i just thought no i just kind of felt there and all that and even i was in recovery i was doing a wee bit of exercises just going for like a walk with um with uh with a few of my friends and stuff and that's kind of helping me a wee bit just to get me a bit of a breather uh, and I mean that I'm in a group with people that just to try and do exercises and out in the bigger parks and the bigger you know trying out and stuff <sighs> I'm just so 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 tired and that is helping me but it's it's way hell so yeah so I won't really do much um, the only thing I can do is just try and get something sorted out for the PS4 and try and get other things working out. Um, so even if I do get a new a new console, a new PS4, it means that the stream the for the stream for Resident Evil 8 will be delayed and being late. Now I won't have enough ideas for the PC games I have. But I will be happy to try and throw in like a little quick gameplay highlights from there. Uh, it, won't, it won't be something like fancy or anything big. Because again, <sighs> I'm going to be more thinking about, more concerned about for that 
up for that. And if you want to what, what's that behind me, well, that is the Devil May Cry song, the Rebellion, from the anime. Um, sorry if I have shit on it, but you might recognise from the Hulk. So that's why I'm putting all my shit back. There you go. So, yeah. So, again, I'm sorry for the amount, amount of time I haven't really did much or anything. I just wanted to talk about what you guys, just wanted to talk about to you guys, um, well, you know, how I'm doing, how I'm recovering and whatnot. And, uh, yeah, I am really nervous because I never usually, and I haven't done like a face, you know, like a vlog with my phone or my webcam for the longest time because I'm a bit nervy. Um, and this is the only option I had to explain and how I, what you guys know about what happened to my console and other stuff. So again, with that being said, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys kind of understand about the vlog I got for you here. Um, I didn't expect it was last about 21 minutes, so I need to wrap this up. So. Again, let me know what you think I should do. Give me hits and give me tips or hint or anything, anything that will help me out. Um, again, let me know if you want me to get the PS, the PC version of Resident Evil 8. But it will be me just trying to, you know, record. I might record two halves of it. That just depending on how if I get stuck, then fair enough. But. <sighs> Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and uh, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, join that mighty legion, hit that notification bell, and uh, stay safe. And sorry for the sorry to wait you guys know know about the bad news I got on my console. Um, again, I will try and walk walk out as much as I can. I will have my comments. I will be looking at any comments what you guys think. Um, and also the one who, and also before I end, before I actually go and end this, yes, I did downloaded the demo, downloaded two demos of Spider-Man Miles Morales because I wanted to give myself a try out before I get the full game. And if you if you're wondering, yes, I am wearing my Van Halla Assassin's Creed T-shirt, so. He, Yes, I am planning on getting that one in the demo if I can, and that way you guys can be, you know, happy for the thing I'm gonna get. Because there was one, because there was one individual in the comment section who says I can't, I want to see what your reaction, what you react to these two games. So I, I'm getting them. It's just that because of that thing died, I just don't know when I will be playing or I will play any game on PS4. So that's all I'm going to say because I'm tired. I'm, I'm real, I'm tired, and I don't want to drag on this video. But again, stay safe. Um, if it's your birthday today, happy birthday, you handsome, beautiful, or uh, you awesome dude or awesome guy. If it's your if it, if it's your birthday, then happy birthday to you, girl. Um, have a have amazing time. Uh, have you know have fun and uh, yeah so I'm gonna end this video here so again we wait we comment subscribe and I will see you guys some point and I will highlight game on PC bye